The Adventist Church responds to the terrible shooting in Las Vegas. La Sierra University said, Hearts are broken. Our prayers go out for the victims of the horrific tragedy in Las Vegas. La Sierra University honors Dr. Edward Allred, who boasted of murdering over 250,000 children in their mother's womb. He boasted of brutally torturing and dismembering hundreds of thousands of children. And La Sierra has an entire center and business program named after this man. A horrific tragedy. This is a complete farce. You celebrate tragedy. You profit from tragedy. Violence and tragedy is the example for your students. It's posted right there on the wall. Pastor Ricardo Graham said, as a church, Seventh-day Adventists reject violence. This is a bold-faced lie. We Seventh-day Adventists do not, we do not reject violence. We do officially, it's right there in our official documents, we officially believe that violence is an answer and it's called abortion. Abortion is physical violence and it is violence against innocent children. We stand against anyone who causes death and injury and are heartbroken for those who are suffering such pain and anguish. This is another bold-faced lie. This man is lying. We stand against anyone who causes death and injury. This is a lie. La Sierra is in the PUC and named Dr. Allred their example to the students. Loma Linda University is also in the PUC and named Allred their distinguished ambassador. These are just two of many institutions in the PUC. They openly celebrate and honor one of the most brutal and violent murderers in the entire history of the USA. The scriptures condemn those who use violence, saying that those who love violence, he hates with a passion. He says very clearly, give up your violence and oppression and do what is right and just. I can't believe I'm even reading this. Look, it's right there in their own words, from their own mouth. Adventists condemn themselves. We Adventists support violence. It's right there in our global worldwide statement. The scriptures condemn the Adventist position on abortion. We are wrong. We are in sin. And our leaders go around making these statements, which is hypocrisy by definition. He says that scriptures condemn violence and that he stands against anyone who causes death. But the Adventist church in the PUC, the PUC built a church for this murderer at his horse racing track. And a church official told me that they are waiting for Allred to die so that they can get all of his money, which was earned from violence and causing death. You know what this is? It is insane. President Ted Wilson said, We believe that Jesus is coming very soon, and then violence and suffering and pain will be brought to an end. It is a documented historical fact that the Adventist Church has practiced abortion in our hospitals in the name of Jesus. It's right there. It's stated right there on your own websites. It is the healing ministry of Jesus Christ. According to the Adventist Church, Jesus is a violent bully who went around Nazareth ripping the arms and legs and genitals off little children. According to the Adventist Church, being a violent bully is an answer. And one day the skies will open up and the violent bully will return and we will spend eternity with the violent bully. Do you know what this is? It is gross and it is disgusting and it is blasphemy. Ted Wilson is the one who made this statement. But, oh that's right, who was the one that brought abortion into the Adventist Church? Oh, that's right. It was Ted Wilson's own father, Neil Wilson, who brought violence against children into the Adventist church. The NAT is deeply saddened and troubled. 58 people lost their lives and more than 500 were injured. 58 people lose their lives and the NAD is sad. But the Washington Adventist Hospital, just down the street from the NAD and GC, has murdered thousands of children and the NAD doesn't say a word. It is a documented fact that the NAD has murdered more black Americans than the KKK, but they say absolutely nothing. When Planned Parenthood Planned Murderhood was caught admitting on camera that they murdered children born alive in order to harvest their body parts, the NAD said what? About all this violence against children, they said what? Oh, that's right. They said absolutely nothing because the NAD supports violence against unborn children. What happened in Las Vegas is a terrible tragedy. But for my Adventist church to posture and put on a front that we are against violence is a complete farce. It is an absolute disgrace. If you want to learn more about the documentation, references, citations, and facts about the history of violence against children in the Adventist church, please see my other videos.